on the ADL stand we have a Plaxton Leopard for Weir Weirdale Motors. Volvo V8R. Nice sticker on the back of this one. This vehicle is full PSVR specification and features a near side centre wheelchair lift. Vehicle can seat 72 passengers. the Gibson family crest on this vehicle. Vehicle's fitted with our Coa alloy wheels and Michelin tyres. Also on the stand we have a ADL BYD Enviro 200 EV. This vehicle is for bus Aaron. Bridgestone's tyres are fitted. Interesting to see they've gone for screw on signs here rather than vinyls. Digital mirrors. Nice cab layout in this vehicle. Nice clear dash pinnacle. Rather large gear selector buttons over there. Hanover EG4 destination equipment fit to this vehicle. On the interior, it's a rather interesting layout. You have a full wheelchair bay with three tip down seats, but you also have a space dedicated to buggies. You also have this nice padding around the bays. USB charging points have been fitted. Information screens in the centre and at the front of this vehicle for passengers. This vehicle does feature the sloped front. Also on the Alexander Dennis stand is one of the first hydrogen enviros. It's heading for Arriva, I believe. 
paid for by the combined authority of Liverpool. interior See, it's the Enviro 400 City design, so it's got the recessed wiper blades, slightly sloped screen. Uh, which one? Uh, well, to be honest with you, Billy's probably been closer to the recent uh, than I have. Uh, but I think we've got the uh, yeah, that is going to be the best of the best. Yeah, that's going to be the best of the best. Yeah, that's going to be the best of the best. Yeah, that's going to be the best of the best. See nice bright interior. Metro branded seating as well. So the hydrogen tanks are behind this panel here and a little bit further down. Here we have a mock-up of the new Enviro 400 EV model. It uses Voith motors for ADL's own battery technology. You can see that motor powers rear axle to each hub. Battery packs are also fitted in the saloon floor. Oh. Uh, it's a on here yesterday. Charging point in the near side rear of what would be the Enviro 400 EV chassis. Yeah. 
on the EVM stand we have the new Novo City Vault from Isuzu. This vehicle is in left-hand drive format, but it's available to order in right-hand drive. It's at the show to give operators an idea of what the vehicle's like. Two hours fast charge. To 350 kilometers range. But they also do this Novo City Vault range in a larger length. The other Isuzu products are the Visigo, which we've already tested on the YouTube channel. This vehicle is bound for Allenby Coach Hire. We also have the Isuzu Gran Toro, which has also been tested on our YouTube channel. And this vehicle is bound for Newport bus for the coach division. It has a Euro 6 Cummings 4.5 litre engine, which is and the floor in the centre of the vehicle. Fleet number D20. Vehicle is in 37 seat format. Allison gearbox. Multi camera CCTV. Here we have the EVM electric composite mobility model. CM for short. This is based on by Vico Daily chassis. So this is a lightweight composite body on this vehicle. See the unladen weight there. PLS wheelchair lift in the rear and the floor. They've done a really good job on the design of this vehicle. It's light and airy, large opening windows, plenty of headroom. Phoenix seating and NMI seat brackets. Overhead luggage lockers. So that's the main thing about this vehicle as well for passengers is when you are stood up, there's still plenty of headroom, even round the entrance and exit area. A standard Iveco dashboard layout. You can see on their brochure there's one for the Education Authority. Elsewhere on the EVM stand you have an exclusive VIP based on a Sprinter, Grand Tourer, also on a Sprinter. Vico daily based Erina Revolution for comfort coaches.
and you also have an e-city line for Sky, for staff shuttle services. Also have a PSVR compliant Plaxton Panther stock for Mistral. Throughout the three days, there is the Masterclass Theatre, which holds numerous seminars. On the Volvo stand, we have the Volvo BZL, all electric single decker. This is the same vehicle that was trialled in Kent with Go Coach. Very light and airy interior in this vehicle. wireless mobile phone charging points and alpha charge phone charging situated on the back of the seats bodywork on this vehicle is by MCV well known partner of Volvo Bus and Coach UK it's finished to very high standard Seat 42 passengers. We also have on the Volvo stand the Volvo 9700, which is the revised version with the newer engine. So it has digital dash pinnacle. This is a vehicle I've previously reviewed on our YouTube channel. From Volvo Bus at Warwick in Coventry. That vehicle did have the older engine in it though and was fully PSVR compliant with side wheel chairlift. You can check that one out on our YouTube channel. This one also has an updated steering wheel with buttons on. This one is a 53 seater and does have destination equipment fitted. Here we have the Sigma 7. We 
this vehicle is a 16 seater is the shortest of the range and you can see the full range on this graphic here Here we have the Sigma 8. Hundred seventy five mile range. This vehicle is a 27-seater, 